And I just realised what I've done. I've not even checked my exposure. One, two, three. I can't see it. I'm just looking again. Hi everyone, my name's Tony and I've been having a massive clear out and I've literally just found my old EOS Canon EOS 3, which is actually a film camera. Now it says here I've got 11 pictures left, so I'm thinking, shall we see what we can get with 11 frames on a film camera? Not quite sure how this is gonna go because normally I shoot with digital and I probably take about 11 frames for one picture. So I'm gonna have to slow right down, think about what I'm doing think about the light and the composition and I might have to just forget about the moment because I don't think we've got time. <laughs> I don't know how people used to shoot on film cameras and literally have like 36, 24 frames for every single wedding. Anyway, let's crack on with today's shoot and see how we get on. Right, you guys, I'm gonna bring you over this way if that's all right in here. And just nice and close together. What I'm thinking is, Demi's got some nice light on her face there. I might use a bit of this bush, bit of that bush to frame them. It's so weird, like not being able to like see stuff. And then now we have to like think about the posing and things. So Demi, I'm gonna get you to put your arm a bit further back. Yeah, I might bring your veil a bit further back as well. Can you imagine like faffing around like this on a wedding day? <laughs> Ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> That's perfect guys, just a bit further back of the arm Demi. Yeah, beautiful. Let's go for it. Beautiful. One, two, three. There's one. <laughs> All right, so my number's going up. So I think I've got about 14 left. God knows what it looks like. <laughs> it's actually quite scary, like not knowing what it looks like. So I'm gonna get a bit closer. <laughs> I've just realized what I've done. I've not even checked my exposure. <laughs> it's probably gonna be pitch black. <laughs> Well, lunatic. <laughs> I've actually got a light meter in the app on my phone. So I've got a 400 film speed in my camera. I always do like my meter in, on, in my camera, uh, but now I'm gonna use this app today. I'm just gonna test the light here. And I want to shoot at, I'm just gonna go for like, let's go health weather at 1.2 and then 1600. Right, let's try again. I'm gonna go for a close up this time. Right, just head nice and close again. Just looking down, Demi. One, two, three. Way. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm gonna come back here a little bit. Go for that first one again. This is so bizarre. See, normally on a wedding day, I'd, I'd be like taking like 15 pictures while this was happening, but we literally don't have time for that. Head's nice and close. There we go, did give you a 10 minute warning then, did I? <laughs> Oh, this is so crazy, it's so hard. I know I didn't get any of the flooring then, so I kind of want to get some of the flooring. I'm going to go a bit further back. So I picked this location because of the colours, really, and the framing of the trees, and I thought the textures would look quite nice. One, two, three. So the only good, <laughs> the only good thing about this is, for my digital photography, I use the Canons, so I can actually just use the same lenses on this. So I'm actually shooting with the 50mm 1.2 that is actually my favourite lens. I've only, <laughs> no, I've only got 10 left. <laughs> oh, right, I think we need to move on before I waste them all there. I can't believe I've only got 10 left already. Just wasted three. You know, on a normal wedding day, I'd take about 15 up four as well. <laughs> can you imagine if I did that with a film? <laughs> I'm so lucky to be shooting at this lovely venue today. Shooting at Eve's Hall in Lancashire, which is such an amazing wedding venue. It really is. Gorgeous little country house in the middle of nowhere. So normally I don't like using the obvious spaces and I kind of like the geometry in the corner of this building, but I know I don't have like the space or the actual frames to experiment. So I'm not gonna waste like too much here. I might take two and that's it and see how we get on. James, can I just pop you with your back against there for me? And then Debbie, your back's gonna be against the wall there. That's perfect. And then just head towards James. Oh, that's nice. Light meter in again. Oh, James has got a nice little smile on his face. It's so weird. I feel like nervous to like press the button. One, two, three. I'm just gonna get you to look down, Demi. One, two, three. I'm just gonna take one more for good measure. I'm actually just using the um, manual focus now because I feel like I'm doing less faffing. Right, one, two, three, guys. One, two, three. There we go. Cool. Right, let's move on. Do you know what my instinct is? My instinct is to do like really safe, boring stuff against like the doors and things, but just because I know that it's probably going to look all right, but 
On the, typically on a wedding day, I would never really play it safe like that because you can be so creative and you've got the chances to take so many pictures and get things right and capture these moments that happen in between people rather than this like one stiff, solid point in time. I'm just gonna use these pillars here and I'm thinking of just shooting down those. That's beautiful, head's nice and close. So weird, because you can't just like test it. Right, ready guys? One, two, three. Can't see it, <laughs> just looking again. <laughs> I think we'll have one more of those. I'm gonna get you to come in front of James this time, Demi, if that's okay. It's also like calm and way more chill, just looking down towards his lips, Demi. Perfect. There we go, and then just one a little bit closer. There we go. Perfect, let's move on to one more place. Yeah, that's good, guys. Yeah, Demi, if you come in front of James, so James is facing me, perfect. And then you're facing me as well, looking back towards James. Perfect. Then you can just get nice and like snuggly close in there. So just looking back towards each other. So what's so hard is, because I shoot digital all the time, I'm so used to just like taking a picture, checking, checking the pose, checking the exposure, checking everything else. Just, yeah, checking the exposure and the pose and everything and it's getting your composition right is so important and getting the moment right is so important. And in digital, you can do that. So I do feel like we are so lucky to be able to take so many pictures in one moment to capture the right moment. Although I am quite excited to see how these turn out. So I am gonna take one again and I have to check my light meter in. So Demi, I'm just gonna get you to like, just wiggle your bum into James a little bit more. <laughs> James is gonna make pig noise in your ear. Are you making pig noises, James? <laughs> there we go. Oh, it's so weird. I just wanna press the button so many times. Uh, it's gonna get nice and close. Yeah, I think just nice and close, like little Eskimo kisses almost. It's so weird, like I just want to take so many. And then just one more here, just looking towards his lips. Beautiful. I have one frame left. I feel like just like, yeah, I'm just going to get in there, make it a fun one. You guys are just going to get nice and close together facing each other this time. And then you are going to have little kisses like the Eskimos do. Little nose kisses, that's it. Rubbing noses together, yeah! And then Demi just looking back towards me. <laughs> like, like you would know, my cute Ted. So yeah, I have just wasted. Maybe not wasted, it might be blurred, might be not, might be in focus, might not be. None of these might turn out, there might be no filming, who knows? So yeah, this was like an old camera that I just kind of found. See what we can get with a half used film compared to taking pictures with a digital camera. And I have to say, it is so difficult. It's so difficult because you want to press the button so many times through all these moments and you want to test your light and you want to test your composition. And I really do feel quite lucky to be able to photograph using a digital camera and create all these lovely moments for couples. So yeah, I hope you like this video. Please be sure to like and subscribe because I have really enjoyed making this. Thank you. Ha, ha, ha.